come to a comfortable seated position on your mat maybe cross your shins or maybe lay your legs out wide keep your neck spine and head in a neutral position grounding your sitting bones into the mat bring your palms on top of your knees start bringing awareness to your breath breathe in breathe out inhale and exhale just begin to arrive here taking a few more breath at your own pace Gently opening your eyes. Inhale, circle sweep your arms to the sky. Bring your arms to be in the same line with your ears. Exhale, release the right hand to the mat. At right with your left hand. Maybe look up to the left palm. Maybe bring the right elbow to the mat to be in the same line with your right hip. Inhale, arms overhead, return to center. Exhale, release your left arm to the mat, arch left with your right hand. Maybe shift your gaze, look up to your right palm. Slowly coming up, inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, left hand to right knee, right hand goes back and twist right. Returning back to center, inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, right hand to left knee, left hand back and twist. And slowly back to center. Interlace your fingers. Inhale, arms overhead, flip your palms to face up. Exhale, bring your chin to chest, send your arms forward for a cut pause. Inhale, arms overhead, push your chest through. Exhale, round your spine, chin to chest. Inhale, send the arms up. Exhale, round. Slowly release, palms find knees again. Bring your palms to the top of your mat, shoulder distance apart, knees back, hip distance apart, toes tucked, tabletop. Inhale, send the right leg up and back for a calf stretch. Keep pushing the right heel against an imaginary wall. Placing your palms into the mat. Take a few breaths here. Next inhale, lift the right foot and step it over the left. Look over your left shoulder for a hip stretch. Keep the right knee straight. Slowly returning back to a tabletop. Inhale, left leg back, calf stretch, second side. Keep the left knee straight, shoulder blades pulling away from each other, palms pressed into the mat. Next inhale, left foot over the right, look over the right shoulder for a hip stretch and breathe here.
keeping the back knee straight, slowly returning to a tabletop. Inhale, right hand up, look right. Exhale, thread the needle, release the right shoulder to the mat and maybe the right ear and cheek too. Keep your hips tucked above the knees. You can stay here or send the left hand up. Maybe use it to wrap your back and hug your right inner thigh. Breathe. Exhale, left palm finds the mat. Inhale, right hand up to the sky. Exhale, back to a tabletop. Inhale, left hand up. Exhale, thread the needle. Release the left shoulder, ear and cheek to the mat. Send the right hand up. And again, you can stay here or maybe use your arm to wrap your back and hug your left inner thigh. Keep opening your chest to the right. Exhale, right palm finds the mat. Inhale, left hand up to the sky. Exhale, back to a tabletop. Now from here, keep your hips tucked above your knees. Walk your hands forward. Let your chin or forehead relax towards the mat. Come to a half puppy pose. Relaxing your upper back with every inhale and sinking deep into the pose with every exhale. Slowly release all the way down to the mat, keeping your toes tucked. Come onto your forearms. Next inhale, lift your hips off the mat. Stay for a few breaths here. Slowly release back into the mat. Plant your palms and tuck your toes. Inhale, lift into a baby cobra. Belly button stays on the mat. Shoulders away from the ears. Elbows squeeze ribcage. Exhale, release. Tuck your toes. Inhale, lift your hips up and return to a tabletop. Lift your knees off the mat, find a floating tabletop for a few breaths. Next exhale, hips up and back, downward facing dog. You can cycle your knees, or maybe sway your hips from side to side. You can bring your knees close to the mat and back up. Just do whatever feels good here. Inhale, roll forward into a plank. Come onto your tippy toes. Then release your lower back towards the mat. Knees straighten off the mat. Exhale, hips up and back. Downward facing dog. Inhale, right leg up. Three-legged dog. Bend the right knee and draw three tiny circles to one direction. And three circles to the opposite direction. Inhale, leg up. Three-legged dog. Exhale, bring the right knee to the right elbow. Go forward. Inhale, leg up, three-legged dog. Exhale, twist left, find left elbow with the knee. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, step the foot between your palms, low lunge.
Release the left palm into the mud, right hand to the sky, easy twist. You should feel a stretch in your right glutes. Slowly returning to a low lunge. Step the front foot to the back, plank pose. Release your knees into the mud, bend elbows back, half chaturanga. Slide through, cobra pose. And release back into the mud, tuck your toes, lift your hips up and back, downward facing dog. Inhale, left leg up, three legged dog. Bend the left knee and draw three tiny circles to one direction. And three circles to the opposite direction. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, go forward and find the left elbow. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, twist right. Inhale, back up. Exhale, step the foot between your palms, low lunge. Ground the right palm into the mat. Left hand to the sky, easy twist. Bringing the palm back to the mat, step the back foot to the front, inhale, hands to shins, flat back. Exhale, fold all the way down. You can cycle your knees. Or maybe hug opposite elbows, let your head get heavy, knees are micro bent into a rug dog. Sway from side to side. Now slowly roll yourself up, vertebra by vertebra, all the way to the top of the mat, find Tadasana. Inhale, lift your heels off the mat, keep the tailbone tucked in, suck the quads in, maybe suck or sweep your arms all the way up. Exhale, find prayer to the chest, heels to the mat. Inhale, backstrap the right hand, left hand goes forward, keep your hips square, shift your gaze, look back to your right thumb. Exhale, bring the right hand over the left, left fingers to the sky. Tug your right shoulder to the left and look over your right shoulder for a shoulder stretch. Slowly release. Inhale, circle, sweep your arms up. Exhale, backstrap the left hand, right hand forward, hips are square, look back to your left thumb. Bring your left arm over the right, right fingers up. Tuck the left arm to the right and look over the left shoulder for a shoulder stretch second side. Keep your shoulder relaxed here. Release. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, find prayer to the chest. Inhale, bend into your knees, arms overhead, chair pose. Make sure when you look down you can see your toes or maybe slightly move your knees back behind your shins. Exhale, belly to thighs, swing arms back, half chair. Inhale, arms overhead, chair pose, sink a little deeper in your chair. Exhale, belly to thighs, half chair. Inhale, chair pose. Exhale, prayer to chest. Now lift the left leg up and back for a high lunge prayer. Anchor the back heel into the mat, open into warrior two. Bend into your front knee, arms are in a T-shape. Look over your right fingers. Go forward with your right hand, flip your palms to face up. Inhale, finding a reverse warrior. Keep bending into the front knee while you lengthen the back knee. Maybe bring your left hand to wrap your back and hug your right inner thigh. 
breathe in exhale lengthen the front knee go forward with the left hand inhale exhale release the right hand alongside the right leg left hand to the sky triangle pose Take a few breaths here. Inhale, find high lunge. Peel the back heel of the mat. Back toes face forward. Bend into the front knee, arms overhead. And maybe release the back heel into the mat. Transition into warrior one. Sending your arms back, interlace your fingers. Inhale, bring your shoulder blades together, open your chest up to the sky. Exhale, hinge forward for a humble warrior. Right shoulder pushes right bent knee out, arms fall overhead, back knee straight. Slowly release, step the back foot to the front. Inhale, finding a flat back. Exhale, fold all the way down bend your knees inhale rise up arms overhead exhale prayer to chest bend into your knees inhale chair pose second round shift the weight from your toes into your heels exhale belly to thigh think swing arms back half chair inhale finds chair pose Exhale, swing arms back, half chair. Inhale, arms overhead, chair pose. Exhale, hum, arms to prayer. Lift the right leg up and back, high lunge prayer. Then anchor the right heel into the mat, opening to warrior to second side. Go forward with your left palm, inhale, exhale, send your trunk back for a reverse warrior. Maybe bring your right hand to wrap your back, hug your left inner thigh. Stay here for a few breaths. Next inhale, lengthen your front knee, go forward with the left hand. And on the exhale, release the hand alongside the leg. Open into a half bind triangle. You can stay here or send the left hand all the way up for a triangle pose. Now slowly find your way into a high lunge. Back heel of the mat, bend into the front knee. And again, you can stay here or release the back foot into the mat. Find warrior one second side. Bend into the front knee while you lengthen the back knee and breathe. Maybe send your arms back, interlace your fingers. Inhale, open your chest up to the sky. And on the exhale, hinge from your hips, fold all the way down. Let your arms fall overhead while you sink deep into your humble warrior. Release your hands to from your front foot, back foot to the front, inhale flat back, exhale, send your palms under your feet for Parahast Asana. Release, inhale, rise up, arms overhead. Exhale, prayer to chest. Inhale, bring the left foot to either the right ankle, right calf, or right inner thigh for a tree pose. Sit. 
Circle sweep your arms all the way up, intensely staring at a gaze point in front of you, taking a deep breath in and a heavy exhale. This will help you maintain stability in the pose. Returning back to prayer. Tip forward while you send that leg back to warrior three. Maybe foot stays on the mat. Maybe it comes off slightly. And maybe it goes all the way up to a complete warrior three. Slowly release back center. Bring the right foot onto the left ankle, left calf. Or maybe left inner thigh. Hands to prayer. Breathe here. Inhale, circle, sweep your arms all the way up. And keep opening the right knee to the right. Hands return back to prayer. Swing the leg back while you tip forward. Warrior three, second side. And just do the same thing you did on the other side. Slowly returning back to Tadasana. Inhale, circle, sweep your arms all the way up. Exhale, swan dive all the way down. Inhale, finding a flat back. Exhale, plant your palms. Step your feet back into a plank pose. Engage your core muscles, straight knees, shoulder blades pulling away from each other, palms pressed into the mat, and maybe find your way into a forearm plank, elbows under the shoulders. You can stay here. Walk your feet towards your elbows for a dolphin pose. Keep pushing the mat away with your forearms. And maybe relax your ankles towards the mat. Maybe send one leg up. Bringing the leg back to the mat. And maybe other leg up. Release back into the mat. Send your feet back. Release everything all the way down. And slowly find your way back to a downward facing dog. Inhale, right leg up. Exhale, right foot to the outside of the right palm. Wide lunge. Keeping the back knee straight. Or maybe release it into the mat. And maybe... Release your elbows as well for a deeper stretch. Just go to your body's extent here. Lifting up and back. Three-legged dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, left leg up. Three-legged dog. Exhale, left foot to the outside of the left palm. Wide lunge. Maybe back knee into the mat and tuck the back toes. And maybe release your elbows into the mat. Keep pushing your hips forward. Slowly coming back onto your palms. Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, downward facing dog. Now release your knees into the mat. Come to a seated position. Bring your glutes onto your heels. Send your arms back. Inhale, lift your chest up. Find a baby camel. 
and maybe transition into a camel pose. Keep pushing your hips forward and let your trunk fall back, head hangs and slowly release back to a seated position. Swing arms forward, far head to the mat, child's pose. Slowly rising up. Swing your legs all the way forward. And windshield wiper your knees from side to side to neutralize your hips here. Take a few rounds. Now lengthen your legs, bend the right knee, bring the right foot to the outside of the left thigh, left hand hugs right leg, right hand goes back and twist. Take a few rounds here. Returning back to center, send your arms to the left for a counter stretch. Rising up and lengthen the knees. Now bend the left knee, step the left foot to the outside of the right thigh, twist second side. Return to the right, bow for a counter stretch. Now find your way to lying flat on your back. Bring your right ankle on top of your left knee. Find a figure four stretch. Slowly release. And now bring your left ankle to the right knee. Interlace your hands behind the right thigh and pull it towards you for figure four straight second side. Slowly release. Hug your knees tight to your chest. And draw three tiny circles to one direction. Feel a massage on your lower back. And three tiny circles to the opposite direction. Hug your knees tight and slowly release into Shavasana.
Now start returning to your body. We go your toes, fingers, deepen your breath. Make a wish for everyone in the world. Wish them good health and happiness. Thank you for sharing your practice with me. Um, peace, peace, peace.